got to own what's yours, plain and simple. People don't know this, but for so many years after I lost weight, these little suckers, these stretch marks, those beauties, those kept photographers from wanting to work with me. They said I was too much work in post-production to have to edit out stretch marks. I've got them everywhere. And honestly, if it wasn't for those stretch marks, I probably wouldn't have started doing what I do now on YouTube because I got denied so much because this was too much work and wasn't pretty. Now, don't get me wrong. There were lots of people in the fitness industry that gave me a chance and I'm indebted to them and the fitness industry was good to me. But if it wasn't for having to overcome these obstacles, I wouldn't be doing what I do today. You have to own your flaws. You have to be your true authentic self and be real. If I wasn't real with myself and didn't accept that this is just who I was and that's my authentic self, I don't know what I'd be doing today.